So that's, uh, I went to the Cubs, and they offered me a managerial job in Peoria, Illinois, A ball, and I jumped all over it. I said, that's what I want to do. I want, do you, to see, the, I want to see if I like it, and I want to see if I'm any good at it. I might, pardon me, Ryan, but uh, not only uh, did you get back into it, but in a sense you got out of it in the same year you got into it because you were run from a game one time in your major league career. And our pal, our mutual friend, Pete Vinokin. Bring up a Pete Vinokin's name. Uh -huh. He actually called me into the office. Uh, he came into my office. Owner of the Peoria Chiefs. Peoria Chiefs. Chiefs. Right. And he was there, what, 25, 30 years as an owner. Uh -huh. And uh, he <laughs> called me in one day and said, hey, Rhino, you're doing a great job with the guys. They're playing well. There's just one thing I want to mention. From this end of it, this is show business. I said, yeah, I know. There's people watching. I, yeah, I get that. You know, WGN I, with the Cubs, I, I went through all that. He goes, no, as a manager, it'd be nice if you get kicked out every now and again, every now and again at home here. He says, that'll sell tickets, they'll come back. I said, really? So I actually took that to heart, and within three days, there was a there was a chance that I had to go out there and argue, and I just stayed out there longer. I said, you know what, now's the time. I'm going to do this for Pete. Pete, this is for you. So I got thrown out in my first game as a manager, my first year. And went on to get thrown on seven more times after that. Eight times in his first minor league managerial uh, year. We'll be back with the final segment from Ryan Sandberg right after this. <laughs> That's great.